Uh, we are following breaking news out of Globe tonight. An hours long standoff between police and a homicide suspect has come to an end. We're learning a shootout broke out between officers and that suspect. Elliot Polikoff just got to the scene. What can you tell us at this hour? Yeah, yeah, we're at the intersection of Golden Hill Road and Russell Road in Globe, and this is very much an active investigation behind me. We do know that the suspect has been taken into custody. We've also learned some new information within the last few minutes that none of the officers involved were injured. The only person injured, according to Gila County representatives, is that the person, the suspect involved, was the one who was injured, and that those injuries are non-life threatening. We just received a couple of new details from the U.S. Marshal Service within the last 30 minutes, saying that at around 4 p.m. this afternoon a shooting occurred in this area in Globe. The U.S. Marshals Task Force, they were investigating a suspect with warrants for weapons violations as well as a recent homicide and that's when they found the suspect here in Globe. When they tried to contact the suspect, he shot at officers with quote, no regard for the safety of the community. He then barricaded himself inside of a residence. Officers attempted to negotiate a peaceful surrender, and then eventually this male suspect was taken into custody. Now, this is related to an incident that took place back on March 3rd, when court documents say that 36-year-old Zane Proctor and this male suspect went inside a business in Mesa with firearms. They were wearing clothing that covered their entire bodies except for their eyes, and they got into a tussle with the victim inside this building and actually ended up shooting and killing the victim. Zane Proctor, he had already been arrested, but this suspect just taken into custody today. We've seen a coordinated effort out here involving the Gila County Sheriff. We've also seen trucks from Mesa Police, also Mesa Fire as well. We don't know any information about the victim from that original March 3rd incident. We know Zane Proctor, he was arrested last week. And when we learn more information about the second suspect, we know he's a male, but we don't know much else. But right now we're working to learn more information. And when we do, we'll be sure to let you know on the AZ Family News app. But for now, Live and Globe, Elliot Polikoff, Arizona's Family.